Good morning, dear students, and welcome to another lesson for English 102 New Language Leader, and the unit is 9.4 Study and Writing Skills. So we have been doing a lot of practice for the process writing. We have been talking about the passive voice because it is recommended that we use it when we talk or when we write about process writing. So let's have a look at the objectives So we have looked at sequencers. You know, you know those words that we use um, to show the sequence of events or to show the, the steps needed to perform something or to do something. So we have looked at that. We have read for specific words when we did the milking process where you had to fill in the blanks with a specific word from the text. So we've done that as well. We have also written a process essay yesterday, and today we're going to do the same thing, inshallah. We're going to do more practice for the process essay. We're going to write um, a process essay, and at the end of the day, inshallah, at the end of the lesson, inshallah, we're going to play a game in which you will have uh, a quiz that has to do with, with, the, with the passive voice. So look at this diagram. How is coffee made? It might be difficult for you to really read the steps needed um, to make coffee. But I will show you another slide that has um, clearer uh, font and you'll be able, inshallah, to read the steps clearly. All right. So I'm just going to go through the steps so that you have a visual idea about how coffee is made. So the first thing is the first step. You pick the coffee beans. You pick the coffee beans. So then you'll be, you will need to change this into passive. So you will say, for example, the coffee beans are picked. The coffee beans are picked. So this is how you do it, all right? So you are given the, the idea. So pick the coffee beans. So this is the first one. The, the second step, dry them you dry the coffee beans after picking them after picking them picking the coffee beans you dry them after drying them you roast the beans they are roasted they are roasted you know using fire and using oven they are roasted then Cool them rapidly so they are they are cooled. Then grind them. Then mix with hot water. Strain the, the, the mixture. You strain the mix, mixture. It means that you separate um, the the uh, the coffee from liquid, which is which is water. All right, then you freeze the mixture. You freeze the mixture. After that, grind the frozen liquid. After that, you dry it in a vacuum. And the last step, you pack into jars. You pack the product or the, the final product into jars. All right, now, Maybe, maybe I just wanted to show you the visual um, steps that are needed to make coffee. Um, now I'm going to show you um, the steps in a clearer 
font. All right. Now, I will say you will have the uh, the Padlet. You will have the Padlet in the chat box. You can do, um, uh, join the Padlet. And I want you to write um, a process essay using these steps. You have 11 steps. So of course you will use sequences. First of all, then after that, next. All right, and of course, when you reach the final step, you will write finally. And of course, you will change them into the pa sorry into the passive voice. So I will do number one for you. Pick the coffee bean. So you will start. Of course, you will write a, an introduction. You will start with an an introduction uh, in which you um, mention the number of steps needed to make coffee. All right. Maybe you will you will talk about the first step and the last step in making coffee. All right, so that's all in the introduction part. All right, and then in the second paragraph, you will start with the the details. You will write about the details, and you will use the passive voice. So, for example, first of all, the the coffee beans are packed. After that, they are dried. So I've done number one for you and I've done number two for you. All right. So in the Padlet. In the Padlet. Um, you can join the Padlet using the link that has been sent to you. In the chat box. All right. So you might want to take a picture of this if you want. They are uh, the um, the diagram. You will you will have it in the uh, in the Padlet, but unfortunately, as I as I told you before, it's not really that clear. So maybe you want to take a picture of this because I will go to the Padlet in a minute to see your answers. All right. So take a picture of this. So that you know the steps needed to make coffee. All right, I will tell you again. Take a picture of this. Using your mobile phone. Um, thank you, Fahad Muhammad Majid, um, for writing the process essay. But I need you to write in the Padlet because I, I would like others, other people or other students to see your answer as well. All right. Fahad Muhammad Majid, thank you so much. OK, now I will go to the Padlet and have a look at your answers. Right. Looks like we've got some some answers already. Let me just, you know, share with you. All right. All right. So we have okay, please write your name in the title. 
Okay, the diagram illustrates the various stages of making coffee clear. This is a complex process. All right. So Taha Fadal Abdul Jabbar, to make a coffee or to make coffee, there there are, it should be there are because it's a plural. There are 11 steps to be followed carefully, starting with picking the coffee beans and ending with packing into jars. Excellent, Taha Fadal. All right. So first of all, the coffee beans are picked from the farms. Well done. Next, the coffee beans are dried and roasted. OK, continue, please. Thank you so much. Well done. Well done. I will choose another one. Let's say Yasin. So Yasin, there are certain steps that should be followed in order to produce coffee beans. I'm going to present the steps which needs which need there is no need for S because you have you have steps. All right, to be done correctly, this process has six steps, starting with growing the coffee plant and ending with roasting the coffee beans. Firstly, coffee plant or 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 beans, I think you mean. And our grown in a warm place was good soil then plants are watered properly um you are not yasin you are not using the the steps that are given in the task okay it's good but you are not using the steps that we have in the slide thank you so much yasin arshad all right let's have a look at another one That's, I'm oh, sorry, no, not this one, not this one. Again, um, Hussain Abdul, Hussain Jamil Abdul Hassan, you are not using, I mean, if this was in an exam, you will be given Unfortunately, you'll be given zero because you are not using the the the, the questions, the steps that are um, used in the questions. You have to use the steps that are given in the question. You don't come up with the new ones. Thank you, Mohammed Nader for showing us the diagram of making coffee. But again, I am more concerned about how you can change the, the, the steps into passive voice. And I would like to see how you use the sequencers. All right, let's have a look at this one. Abdul Aziz. Firstly, the, the, the car, OK, now, you should start with an introduction first, Abdul Aziz. So there should be an introduction. So firstly, the coffee beans are picked by the farmers. Then the beans are dried by the heat of the sun. Well done. Next, the beans are being cooled and frozen. There is no need to use uh, the, uh, the uh, present continuous passive Abdul Aziz. We are not talking about an action happening now. We are up talking about an action that happens on a regular basis. So it should be present simple passive. So the beans are cooled. All right. There is no need for being present continuous passive. No need for that. So next, the beans are being cooled and frozen. Well done. After that, it is 
it, there should be, you know, a post and an apostrophe here because this one is different, right? It's this is like you know, um, for example, Bahrain is an island. It's a flag is made up of red and white. It's a flag, right? Now this one, it means that it is, right? So it is grinded and mixed with boiling water. Then it's a frozen again and turned. There should be ed here, turned into liquid. Finally, the coffee is filled into jar and sold. Now this this is wrong. It should be sold. Can I change? No. All right. So this one should be sold. All right. Thank you, Abdul Aziz. Nice try. Nice try. All right. Let's have a look at this one. This one looks good. All right. So Hussain Naja Abdullah Masoud to make coffee there are 11 steps to be followed carefully starting with picking the coffee beans and ending with uh packing into jars of all the coffee beans are picked from the farms the introduction is is good you should leave some space or you should leave a line and then start the second paragraph next the coffee beans are dried and roasted after that they are cooled down. OK, you should continue, but you are you are on the right track. You're doing well. You're doing well. I think this is a complete answer, maybe. This is a complete answer, maybe. So Yusuf Mahsin Ali Hamad. There are certain steps that should be followed in order to produce coffee beans. I am going to present these steps which need, there is no need for S to be done correctly. This process has 11 steps starting with picking the coffee beans and ending with packing the coffee beans into jars. Um, I mean, there is no need for beans because they, the coffee beans have been made into something not, I mean, something like, you know, uh, uh, powder. It's like powder. It's, it's, no, it's no, I mean, the coffee beans are no more beans. They have been made into powder. It's like powder. So there is no need for, for beans here. First of all, there the should be a comma after. First of all, there should be a comma here. First of all, the coffee beans are picked from the plants. Then the coffee beans are dried so we can get all the water out of them. All right. After that, coffee beans are roasted. Next, coffee beans are cooled rapidly. Next, coffee beans are grinded. Then the coffee beans are mixed with hot water. Then the mixture is strained. After that, the mixture is frozen, not freezed, frozen. The past participle of freeze is frozen then the frozen liquid is grinded mm, the frozen liquid is grinded really mm, i'm not sure i have to go back to the steps is it is it correct no it's not right because you can't really um grind the liquid <laughs> yeah all right i think i think you should correct this one anyway then coffee beans are dried in a vacuum. All right. Finally, the coffee beans or coffee because it's no more coffee beans. Yeah, it's no more coffee beans. It's just 
coffee powder. So coffee are packed in, in jars or into jars after buying them and they are ready to be sold in the market or to the retailers. Yeah, yeah. Um, this is good. This is a complete answer. Yusuf Mahsan Ali Hamad. Thank you so much. I think I would give you nine out of ten. Yeah, no, this is nine out of ten. Well done, Yusuf Mahsan. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I think this is also a complete answer. Maybe this is a complete answer. I'm not sure. Farooq Muhammad. Farooq Muhammad. Yeah. Well done. I mean, it looks good. You have three paragraphs starting with the introduction, and then you have the steps using the sequencers. Yeah. Unfortunately, I can't read everything, but but it looks good. I will just read a few lines. Your introduction is is good. Um, first coffee plant or um, oh my god, but you are not using the steps in the question. Yeah, Farooq. I mean, it looked good, but unfortunately, you're not using the steps that we have in the question. I'm really sorry. I mean, if you wrote that in a quiz, you will get a zero, unfortunately. Because you're not answering the, the, the question. <laughs> OK. Let's see. It's the same thing, unfortunately. Yeah. You're not really answering the question. Some people are writing about pasta, which is way off. All right, let's have a look at this one. All right, no, no. It's not, he's not really answering the question. Okay, let's go, let's go. I will just read a few more and then we will have um, a competition for the passive voice. Um, this line we have have 11 steps to have coffee. It's it starts with picking the coffee and ending with putting them in jars. First of all, coffee beans are picked by farmers. OK, you should have full stop here, said Jad. So Jada saying you should have full stop here. You should stop. Secondly, of course, capital letter. Secondly, coffee, we dry them. Okay. Now we should use the passive voice. So you start with the object.
All right. Um, coffee beans are picked by farmers. Secondly, coffee, we dry them. So it should you should make it into passive. So you should you should say coffee is dried. All right. Thirdly, we roast the coffee beans. Now, so that this is correct, but I want you to change the active sentences into passive voice. So you should say coffee beans are roasted. All right. Thank you so much, Sajjad. Now the past participle for grind is grounded, not um, grinded. It's grounded. This one is grounded, not grinded. All right. So the past participle for grind is grounded. All right. So this one looks good. Let me just read it for you. Maybe this is the last one and then we're going to have um, quizzes. So there are certain steps that should be followed in order to produce coffee. In the following lines, I'm going to present these steps which need to be done correctly. This process has 11 steps, starting with picking up the, the coffee beans and ending, ending with, it should be with, packing it in jars. All right. Firstly, of course, this should be capital letter. Firstly, and then you have, you should have comma. Firstly, the coffee beans are collected, then dried. After drying the beans, they are roasted. You should have fellow stuff here. Plus, then they are cooled. They are cooled rapidly. After that, the beans are grounded. So you should change that. They are grounded with how with and mixed with hot water. Also the mixture. Then the mixture is strained. All right. You should be careful about, you know, how to form the passive voice. Finally, the coffee jars are ready to be sold. This one should be sold, not sold. Should be sold. Yeah, just. All right, so let's just, you know, have a look at my model answer. So maybe yours are better than mine, but this is just an idea of how it should be done. All right, so coffee undergoes a number of steps before it gets to us. There is a total of 11 steps that need to be followed carefully. Maybe you can say starting with blah, 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 and ending with blah, blah, blah. All right. First of all, coffee beans are picked after that. So I'm using uh, sequencers. After that, they are dried. Then the beans are roasted. Following that, they are cooled rapidly. After that, they are ground and then mixed with hot water. Then the mixture is strained and frozen. Next, the frozen liquid is ground then it is dried in a vacuum finally the coffee is packed in jars so this is the long process of making coffee 
the packed coffee then is taken to retailers to be sold to the public. All right. Now we're going to have like now a game. Going to go to quizzes now. Sorry for the delay. All right. All right, let's give it a go. Just go to join my quiz now. And enter the code. You need to hurry because we're running out of time. All right, just join the game now. Try to get in the game as quickly as you can.
All right. Yes, so get in the game as quickly as you can. So we might need like five minutes extra. We might, I mean, we, we can't finish on time, but you know, just in case we run out of time before um, finishing the game. So we might take like five minutes extra or or we may not, we may not. Yeah, it, it depends on how things go. I will start after two minutes. All right, so basically you will have the first six questions. You will have to choose the right answer. And then the the next um, six questions, you will have to choose um, the correct answer, the correct. Um, the correct answer as well. But it's a, li a little bit different from the previous six questions. And then the the last three questions, you will need to fill in the blanks. You you will need to write the uh, correct answer. Of course, from today's lesson, it all has to do with today's lesson and today's vocabulary as well. All right. So one, two, and three. I'm going to start. So the cows are are give giving given. past participle of give is given all right all right we have yes 45 correct answer so the cows are given yeah they don't give grass the cows do not give grass they are given grass to eat they are given grass to eat all right next question so the roasted beans is b or So the roasted beans, of course, it is are, are given or are, are, sorry, are dried. So the roasted beans are dried.
the packed coffee is taken to retailers to what? To is sold, to be sold, to are sold. Of course, you need the infinitive form of the verb to be, which is, of course, be. So the packed coffee is taken to retailers to be sold, to be sold. Yeah, because after two, you need the infinitive of the verb to be, which is to, sorry, which is be. Dates printed on the milk jug. All right. So the answer is R because it's plural. The milk is tested, test, testing. And the answer is tested. <clears throat> the butter fat be separated are separated, is separated. All right, next question. <clears throat> Which one is correct? The car is washed. The car is washing. The car is washed. So which one is correct? There are two answers or two sentences that are incorrect. So which one? of the three is correct. Right, so the answer is the car is washed. This is the correct answer. Which one is correct? The room vacuum. The room is vacuum. The room is vacuuming.
So the answer is. All right, so the vacuum, sorry, the room is vacuumed. The food needs to, is frozen, be frozen, are frozen. And the answer is needs to be frozen. Yeah. After two, you need the infinitive. All right, this is good. Which one is correct? The fish is cut into small pieces. The fish is cut into small pieces. The fish cut into small pieces. Now the past the past participle of cut is also cut. So it is cut, past simple is cut, and the past participle is also cut. Yeah, I mean this this is a little bit tricky because you would think that it is cutted, but it's not. It's just cut. It's the same. I mean, there are verbs in English that they stay, I mean, they stay the same when you change them into the past or the past participle. I mean, this is how it goes. Which one? Be careful now. This is incorrect. Which one is incorrect? Incorrect. The door is fixed here. I want the door to be fixed here. The door fixed here. You choose the, the one that is incorrect. Incorrect. <laughs> so there, there are two sentences that are correct, but there is only one sentence which is incorrect, which is the last one. The last one is incorrect. Yes, the last one is incorrect. Yeah, the door is fixed here. This is correct. I want the door to be fixed here. This is correct. The door fixed here. This is incorrect. All right. Now, you need to fill in the blanks with a word. Oh, sorry. Maybe. No, we haven't reached that yet. All right. So, the, so again, it's incorrect. The vegetables need to be washed. The vegetables are washed. The vegetables is washed. So again, which is incorrect?
All right, so the incorrect answer is the vegetables is washed. This is the incorrect answer. Yeah, you got it. Now you need to fill in the blanks with one word. So the dried beans are from today's lesson, of course, with hot water. Do you remember the word here? The dried beans are with hot water. Now, the clue here is with, with. Yeah? So what do, you, what do we put here? Yeah, I mean, it could be, but unfortunately, it's not among the answers. Yeah. I mean, yes. All right. So we got mixed. Yeah, the word is mixed, but you can have other other possible answers. But the thing is that you should uh, use words that have been used in today's lessons. That That's, you know, the main thing. I mean, you can have other possible answers. This is fine. But the word that should be used here is mixed. Yeah, it should be, yeah, mixed. All right, next one. So the coffee is is packed into chocolate. Yeah, I think. This is, I mean, you are giving the answers as well. <laughs> Looks like there is a problem, a problem with the, the question. I mean, the word pack should have been missing. But anyway, <laughs> you know the word. <laughs> so the coffee is packed. Yeah, so packed. So we're going to um, drop this question. I mean, go to the next one. Really sorry. So it should be the coffee is packed. All right, let's go to the next question. The coffee beans are, yeah, this one is okay. So this is the last question and we will finish with that. So the coffee beans are, you need to write one word only, only one word under the sun. Uh, the word is, of course, from today's lesson, the word is dried, yeah, silver bullet. I think he's the number one, yeah, dried. The word is dried. So the coffee beans are dried. All right, I think that's the last question. Let's end and let's have a look at the winners of today's competition. So we have in the third place, Sadiq Jafar. And we have in the second place, second place is who? Um, I don't know how to pronounce this word anyway. Yeah, silver bullet is number one. And then we have Yamate, Koda, Sai is number two. And we have Sadiq Jafar in the third place. Thank you so much. Uh, I really enjoyed it. Uh, I hope you did as well. 
Uh, thank you for participating in Kahoot, uh, sorry, in, not Kahoot, in quizzes and in the Padlet. Um, see you inshallah next week. And this is bye-bye from me.